This weekend, the Van Wezel Performing Arts Hall announces the full lineup of shows for the 2014-15 season. Now, we can't reveal everything to you yet, but tickets already are on sale for some shows and performers. Executive Director Mary Bensel is trying to expand the reach of the Van Wezel programs by booking more acts that will appeal to a broader demographic. So you can expect shows that will appeal to the hall's traditional older audience and some programs that should attract younger people as well. You'll find a little bit of both in the shows already revealed, like country singer Martina McBride and jazz artist Diana Krall. It will be a big year for comedy, beginning with Bill Maher, host of HBO's Real Time in October, Wanda Sykes in November, and Kathy Griffin bringing back her caustic look at the celebrity world in April. Dance fans will be able to watch the top ten from this summer's So You Think You Can Dance and get reacquainted with the gender-bending Le Ballet Trocadero de Monte Carlo, which has been absent for many years. Alvin Ailey also is coming back. Broadway star Brian Stokes Mitchell will be the special guest of the Cincinnati Pops, and the Boston Pops will be back with conductor Keith Lockhart. The Tony-winning hit Jersey Boys will be in Sarasota for a full week, telling the story of the rise and fall of Frankie Valli in the Four Seasons. Audra McDonald, who charmed a small crowd a couple of years ago, will be back for the second time as a record breaker, now that she's won her sixth Tony Award. You also have a chance to laugh along at the political satire of the Capitol Steps, enjoy some holiday-themed programs with Dave Koz and Mannheim Steamroller, and be reunited with music legend Kenny Rogers. And that's just the beginning of what will be featured in the coming season. You can find the entire lineup in Sunday's art section in the Herald Tribune and online at artsarasota.com. For opening night, I'm Jay Handelman.